today is to harvest in this sweet corn. Rather amazed we've actually got any to harvest. I'll see if I can find a photograph of what this looked like a couple of days after we'd planted it. Should we show our disaster? Oops. Go on then. Not everything survives being planted out. This sweet corn is our failure of the moment. It's weird because every time we plant sweet corn, the wind picks up and it didn't fail to do it this mm, time. Despite. I put the barrier up to try and protect them a bit, but they got a real battering, didn't yeah. they? Just have to, we'll give them a week or so and see what happens. Well, I'd say a lot of them were dead. Some are nearly dead and the mm. rest are properly dead. It wasn't a pretty sight and I was all ready for pulling it up and replanting something else, but it looks like we'll get a few decent cobs off this. We took one the other day as a tester and it was fine. So we're now going to get in here, harvest it and see what we get off these cobs. Some of them look all right to me. As well. I reckon they're good, don't you? Yeah. So we're heading for the sweet corn now? Yeah. Okay. The sweet corn, if you remember, nearly all got pulled up, didn't it? I was all for pulling it up and putting something else in. When I first put it in, it was battered by the wind and we ended up sort of with very dead looking plants. We'll have to put a picture in the corner so that you can see just what we were dealing with. But there just seemed to be a little bit of growth in the middle. So I persuaded you to leave them, didn't yeah. I? Am I all right to start on these? So now you're going to harvest them. I think this is the one I pulled one off yesterday, so it's a bit all that good. There's usually one good one on each. Yeah, so this stem, is a good isn't one, it? isn't it? This is the good one on this one. Is it nicely browned? It isn't yeah. it? There's some on this one. On this one. This one. There's two on this one that look all right. It's that one. They're tough, aren't they? Yeah. Tricky out there. I think that's it, don't you? Yeah, I think so. In the jungle. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah. Took us 10 or 15 minutes, that's what we've got off. Count up those cobs later on. There's a few left on that may or may not ripen. Have to wait and see what happens to those. I think we've got quite a decent haul off those thinking about what we had when they started, don't you? Yeah, I do. Sort this out then, Are now. you glad that I persuaded you to leave <laughs> yeah. them? <laughs> yeah. Besides harvesting our sweet corn, which is early bird, as you have seen on our other video, we are we harvested some sweet candle carrots. Sue's picked some dahlias, some sweet peas, and some cosmos in there. We've got one little Zaragoza cauliflower, some sweet peas, a few John J. raspberries and some Loch Ness blackberries, probably our last punnet of Marjorie's seedling plums, some all gold raspberries, some safari dwarf French beans, some beetroot boltardy and some cobra French beans. And there are a couple of romance carrots that I missed when I was clearing the row. So, another reasonable harvest. We're off now to get our sweet corn frozen. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.